Hello, everybody. This is not a live recording. This is just a uh, recording. But I wanted to play through a game that I saw on Steam, and I thought it was really cool. Uh, at least the concept of it. It's a uh, basically you're an alien, and it's a short game. So um, I'm looking forward to seeing exactly what it is. It's called The Old Tree, and it's for free. You can find it on Steam. I'll leave a link in the description below uh, when we play it. So, but I I just wanted to open up. Um, and I kind of had to start the video recording before I started the game because it kind of just launches you directly into the game. There's no like, there's no like title screen or anything like that. So I wanted to like give you guys like the whole thing from the very beginning. So I think I've got my OBS set up correctly. I'll probably like make sure of that when we launch the game, but here we go. So hopefully... Hopefully this is working the way it's supposed to. I will check this, of course. The old tree. All right. Um, let me just check my OBS software, make sure. Yes, it is the way that it should be. So, see the... Ah, so you click the little red dot, I see. And there I am. A little alien guy. Now how, what am I supposed to do now? I see, oh, okay. So it's kind of like a point and click adventure game. Oh. Okay. Well, this is... Okay, this is interesting. Um, need to probably click on the red dot. That turns on the lights. Uh, yes. We are making our way through the tunnels. I'm not actually moving him. He's moving on his own, so... Which is good. I don't think I can move backwards, so it is just a point-and-click adventure game. But I love point-and-click adventure games, so this is going to be great. I'm sure that we will not have any problems at all. Ha. Huh. Hello. I see. Ah, I think what I have to do is wait till this guy comes underneath that, maybe? Like, when he comes back. Okay. Now what? Is there like a... Oh, okay, so he, I've, okay, okay, I think what I gotta do is I gotta wait till he gets it, and then it's gotta drop on me. So he's gonna get it, and then it's gonna drop, no? Is there something else I'm supposed to click on, like? If it's not supposed to drop on me... Ah, okay. Okay, that made sense. All right, we are making progress. Boy, this is a cute little game. I love the art style. The art style is really nice. Um, oh. Okay. See, we can click the bell. <laughs> oh, okay.
Yes! Awesome! Okie dokie then. Press all the buttons. Uh... Like, is it supposed to be like... Ah, okay, okay. Yeah, follow the pattern, follow the pattern. I like the puzzles in this game. This game has a lot of good puzzles. This is really nice. Um, is there a... Aha! Huh. We're gonna get all of these screws taken off. And there he goes! Lighting our way. Like a little good little guy. I. I really like you, little guy. Thank you for lighting our... Oh, what is that? What is with the red? I do not like the red. Are those eyes? That is most... Huh. Ah. Nice. The puzzles in this game are fantastic. I do love the puzzles in this game. Oh boy. That's not good. What will I have to do here? Okay, something with... Ah, that was easy. That was easy enough. We are making progress, ladies and gentlemen. We are going to become a tree. I think this is like a seed. It would make sense if it was an old tree. And this was a seed of a tree. An alien tree. Oh my. What are you? Okay, well. What are you? I like your design, but what are you? Okay. Ah, so we click the button, then we wait for the bug. And I think what's supposed to happen is, like, the bug... You're supposed to time it to where the bug hits the item. I think? Maybe? Oh, I, I almost did it. I almost did it. I almost did it. Well, I'm not entirely sure what the bug was for. Because, I don't know. I don't know what the bug was for. Um, I really don't. Uh, 
I'm not sure if it was meant to like sabotage the guy's meal or Ugh. or what are we going into a closet this room. We have a valve. We have this twig-like thing over here. So what what was what's the point of draining it if you can Is there something else now in this room that you can do now that it's drained Like the water goes in Oh, okay. Okay, and then we drain it. Oh, that's clever. That's really clever. Okay, so we drain it. And then we open up this, and then he's able to... Oh, that was a really clever... That was a really, really clever uh, puzzle. I really love that. I really like that. Um, that was a lot of thought process, and uh, kudos to the de developers for that. And again, the art style is just awesome. Um, that is a giant spider web. Hopefully we do not run into the spider that made that web. And I'm assuming that looks like the giant spider that made that web. I do not like this. I do not like this. Oh, oh, for a moment I thought that was the giant spider that made that web. <laughs> Glad it was not. I do not like spiders. Oh, wow. I was not ex- okay. Huh. We're in space. I guess we really are an alien little guy. Okay, was not expecting that. Oh, we are floating away. Hopefully, is this okay? We're floating. Oh, okay. Well, wonderful. We helped the little guy escape. That 
was fantastic. Um, I, mm, okay. Well, I am happy we did that thing that with which we did. That has been the old tree. We are a seed of the old tree. We, we managed to escape. We faced all the obstacles, including Salt Man and the Squirrel. And, uh, wow, that was a really cool experience. I loved the puzzles. The puzzles were great. The atmosphere of the game was great. I loved that everything in there, um, in the game. In fact, hold on one second. Hold on one, just, just one second. Yeah, I love the fact that in the game you had, the artwork was great. Um, and it, it had such a feel to it, right? Like there was just something about it that was just mesmerizing. Um, I loved the background music. I thought the, I thought the soundtrack was really nice. Um, it's just a very short experience, but it, it's like one of those experiences where, you know, it's all about life and just, um, helping life get its start. And uh, I loved it. I thought it was great. I th like the the puzzles were awesome. Uh, the mechanics were cool. It was a point and click adventure game, um, which are really nice. You know, those are really. I I think that if you do one well, like this was of short, but it was a nice experience. It was a very sweet experience. It was a very heartwarming experience, and I really liked that um, in a game. And we don't see that very often because so many games today are so action based and so so um open world and rpg-esque that we don't see a whole lot of like just simplified stories told through games where it's like point and click adventure games i i really like point and click adventure games and so i think that this was definitely worth playing and that you should definitely go check it out if you're interested. Um, but yeah, no, it, it, it's a really cool game. Um, and we managed to, you know, we, we got through the tree. We got through the old tree. And now we are the new life going out to be our own tree. Um, and to spawn our own seeds. And to have our own life live within us. And so I think that's really cool. Um, and kudos to the, kudos to the developers again. Because... Uh, the aesthetics, the, the feel of the game. I loved when you stepped out from the old tree and you were in space. I loved the feeling of that, the transition of that, and the way that the vibrant colors of space were out there. You know, it was just like, now that we have exited the old life, now we are anew and we are floating out into space, into the newness, into the unknown and I, I love that. It's a, it's a good sense of adventure uh, awaiting us at Journey's End. And really, if you think about it, in this game, the Journey's End is this little guy's beginning. And I think that it's a statement to all of us that we can all have those moments where uh, even though one chapter of our lives uh, is done, that doesn't mean it's the end. Every day is a new day for a new chapter of our lives. And so I very much enjoyed this experience. I hope you have too. Um, if you have, please subscribe to the channel uh, and leave a like down below. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.